Welcome to our demonstration on Virtual Machine Resource Management. In this video, we will cover three of the basic concepts of Virtual Machine Resource Management – shares, reservations, and limits. Shares specify the relative importance of a virtual machine. If a virtual machine has twice as many shares of a resource as another virtual machine, it is entitled to consume twice as much of that resource when these two virtual machines are competing for resources. A reservation specifies the guaranteed minimum allocation for a virtual machine. For example, we want to make sure a certain virtual machine always has access to at least one gigabyte of physical memory. We can configure a reservation for that VM guaranteeing access to one gigabyte of physical memory. A limit specifies an upper bound for CPU, memory, or storage I.O. resources that can be allocated to a virtual machine. A server can allocate more than the reservation to a virtual machine, but never allocates more than the limit even if there are unused resources on the system. The limit is expressed in concrete units, such as megahertz of CPU or megabytes of memory. These three settings can be viewed in the vSphere web client. With Linux VM1 selected, we click on the Manage tab, expand CPU. There we can see shares, reservation, and limit. These settings can also be seen for memory. To better understand shares, let's look at an illustration. On the left side of the illustration, we have two VMs that are configured the same and have the default CPU share allocation of 1,000 shares. One VM is a test VM and the other is a production VM. We want to make sure the production VM gets the majority of the CPU resources when there is contention for those resources in the environment. Changing the shares for the production VM from 1,000 to 2,000 accomplishes this goal, as shown on the right side of this illustration. Let's configure Linux VM1 to have 2,000 CPU shares, as we just saw in the illustration. We click Edit, Expand CPU, and change the share setting from Normal to High, which adjusts the share count from 1,000 to 2,000. Click OK to save the changes. After a few moments, we can see the share setting is now 2,000. In this next example, we need to guarantee Linux VM2 will always have access to 1,024 megabytes, or 1 gigabyte, of physical memory. With Linux VM2 selected, we click Edit, Expand Memory, enter a reservation of 1,024 megabytes, and click OK to save the change. After a few moments, we can see the virtual machine has a memory reservation of 1,024 megabytes. In some cases, it might make sense to limit the amount of resources a virtual machine can use. For example, a development environment. Here, we want to limit our virtual machine to use no more than 4,000 megahertz of CPU resources. We click Edit. Expand CPU, specify 4000 MHz as the limit for this virtual machine, and click OK to save the change. After a few moments, we see our virtual machine is now limited to 4000 MHz of CPU resources. This concludes our demonstration on Virtual Machine Resource Management. Thank you.